10 seconds into your open with Don, I said, this is not going to be a problem. It seems like every other Nesson or Silo Remy broadcast, how did it feel to you? Well, it felt good, John. I mean, it felt good to be back, yeah. obviously. And, uh, uh, you know, I was I was nervous uh, the day before, and I got up early yesterday. I got up about 6 o'clock in the morning, which I don't normally do, you know, for a 1 o'clock game. <clears throat> Excuse me. But when I got there, you know, got to the ballpark, I, I found my comfort zone. And I, I was, you know, I was happy with the way things went. For the most part, it was a pretty good game until the end. And, uh, you know, I'm glad it's over with. Uh, tell us how nervous you were, Remdog, and tell us um, how it feels going forward. Do you think uh, that, that the tough part's over now and it'll just be baseball for you now and won't be any distractions? No. Well, uh, you know, for me, it's going to be. I mean, that's what that was, was the whole idea is to come back and do baseball now. You know, what if the public thinks is going to be two different things? You know, I, you know, there'll be people that are happy that I'm back. There are the people that are not going to be happy that I'm back. Uh, but I've made my decision, and I've made my decision to go on and be myself uh, yeah, during a game, and, and, and that's what I plan on doing. And if uh, if that plays well, great. Uh, if it doesn't, uh, I'm sure the people at Nesson and the people with the Red Sox uh, will make the proper adjustments. But, uh, you know, this is the way I, I'm going to go about doing things. And I was nervous. Uh, you know, I've, I've never been nervous for a spring training game except my very first one. And uh, but you know once I got to the ballpark and once I got into my comfort zone and and back on with Don who made it very easy for right. me I, you know it, it, it felt right. Who who's not happy that you're back? Are you hearing from a lot of? Uh, uh, oh, people? I don't know. No, I don't. I don't go into the. Uh, you know, I, I mean, I certainly read stories, but I don't go into the comments after. You know, uh, so I mean, I I don't know. I, I'm sure there are people that are that are not happy. You know. But I can't control that, and I can only control what, what 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 I'm trying to do. And what I'm trying to do is is move on with my life, and I'm trying to get my family to move on with their life. And and I figure this uh, this you know me being an example in that regard uh, it will be a good example for everybody else. So I you know it just it just it was just nice to get back in this atmosphere that I've been in for 27 years and, and actually 40 years. Uh, in professional baseball, and, and it just made me feel good to be back up there doing that. You know, you didn't really address the situation with your son, Jerry, when, when you were on the air at all yesterday, which I thought was actually the right move. I think it would have seemed sort of forced in, in, to do so. Was there any discussion behind the scenes? Did anybody at Nesson want you to, to talk about something at the top, or was it just going to be baseball from the start? No, it was going to be baseball because, um, I, you know, I made my <clears throat> press conference back before I left. I did that for a reason so that when I got down here, uh, I could just, you know, answer questions about baseball and talk about baseball and not talk about my personal life, you know. With, uh, that's that's what I wanted to do when I had that little uh, uh, conference back uh, at Nesson prior to coming to spring training. I didn't want it to be a distraction when I get down here. Uh, I did not want to mention it on the air. I, I said all I had to say about everything. And um, if it wouldn't be fair to anybody else uh, listening to a game to have to listen to that. So, uh, that was my my feeling, and uh, we, you know we we just discussed. You know, Don asked me how are we going to go about this, and I said we're going to do a game, mm. and I said we're going to do a game the way we always do it, and and that's it. Final question on that subject. I suspect the reaction to yesterday specifically was pretty unanimously positive. Is that the as best you can tell, Jerry? I hope so. I got a lot of nice texts, a lot yep. of nice phone calls last night from Good. people who matter to me, and uh, they were very pleased. Uh, you know, with the way things had gone, and very pleased with the way. Um, you know, uh, I guess I presented myself yesterday, so um, so that makes me feel good, and it's it's people that I care about, it's people I know very very well, and um, you know, so from from that point of view, you know, I know they'd be honest with me. For more, visit weei.com/video.